Hey guys, it's Dell. We're back with Mother One. So, let's go. Oh boy. Right off the bat, we get a little flying saucer. Or just a little saucer. But we're going to be taking the train. First to Reindeer, and then to Snowman. Those are literally the names of the cities that we're going to. Let's go ahead and... Uh, Use the laser beam on the car, and then Nintendo attacks the mad truck. Takes it down one hit. He must be one strong motherfucker. Must put the Hulk to shame or something. Alright. So. Mad car's down. Mad truck's also down. And hopefully no enemies show up. There's the rocket. That's was to clear the rocks away. All right, we're in the train station. I don't know how far this train goes, but you need a ticket to ride. Care to buy one? Well, we'll go to Reindeer first. There's also Spookane, but we're not gonna go there yet. We'll go to Snowman after we're done with uh, Reindeer. Yeah, this is the, the train's gonna take us there. And no, you can't hold B to make the game go faster, to make the train go faster. It doesn't work. But it still goes at a decent pace, so it's good. We're almost there, hopefully. Yeah, that was a long tunnel. I didn't expect it to be that long. But we're almost there. Alright, here we go. Now talk to the lady over there. Are you going to Snowman? Yes. I found this hat. I believe it's the property of a girl who lives there. Please take it to her. And she leaves. It is a hat for Anna. Which is the other character we're going to be getting on our team. Now, you don't have to actually go here. But I want to get some stuff before I go to Snowman. The cranky old lady. Or the bag lady, actually. But yeah, I'd, I'd say she's pretty cranky. Picked up a hamburger. <laughs> That's good. From a bag lady. Alright, so let's go to the uh, department store. Hey, what's this guy doing here? My manager's existence does not matter. My importance is so small that I may not be missed should I disappear. Okay, well... I don't know, I had the feeling that he would have been an enemy, kind of like the ones in, uh, Podunct. The ones that were pseudo-zombies. Actually, let's go ahead and pick up some cash before we go. Let's see, yeah, cash card. I don't know why I'm having so much trouble. Let's go ahead and pick up the cash. And we should be good to go. get a plasma beam it's a weapon for Lloyd to use so I want to get that for Lloyd because he's gonna need it so now we're gonna be going off to uh, you know a snowman but I think I should pick up a little more cash before we go there we go now let's go to snowman okay I'm a little lost here you know, I sometimes don't know how to get out of here, but I think this is the way. Small dog houses. Yeah, here we go. It's this way. Yep. Oh boy. Who is it this time? Flying saucer. Or little saucer. Yeah, I've been calling them flying saucers because that's pretty much what they are, but they call them little saucers. Alright. Oh, another enemy. What the heck? It's the same shit. Little saucer. Okay. I think we're almost at the train station. We better get there now. There we go. Alright. Now let's go to Snowman. Alright. 
Here we go again on the train. The music's pretty good. Should have mentioned that earlier. I mean, the soundtrack to Mother 1 is awesome, so of course it's going to be good. Everything's all white because it's all snow. Hence, it's called Snowman. Alright, you can actually catch a cold around here, so be aware of that. Oh crap, it's a polar bear! It's basically like the bear, but it's white. And it's a polar bear. There's a plasma beam. Ooh, you'd think that would kill it! Yeah, the enemies just keep getting stronger. Oh boy, one step and another polar bear. I don't know why, but whenever I look at that thing, I'm always reminded of uh, the Wampa from Star Wars Episode V, the one that tried to kill Luke, and then Luke grabbed the lightsaber and cut his arm off. You know, the Wampa gave me nightmares at one point. Like, it literally gave me a nightmare. Not scared of it anymore, but... When I was like nine. Yeah. Oh, now we got a lone wolf. Well, I think it's a lot more dangerous than the other wolves. Hopefully the plasma beam does the trick. Yep, it did. Alright. So, mm. It's Bigfoot! So he's real after all! Or in the mother universe he is, anyway. <laughs> oh boy, PK Freeze Beta. That can't be good. I'm almost running out of HP. But we took care of Bigfoot. Let's go ahead and heal ourselves with the big bag. Let's go ahead and use another one. On Ninten. Um, let's continue on. Oh, here's the town. Let's go ahead and buy some stuff. Hold on, let's talk to this guy. Let's buy the frying pan. That's it. Love the music here, it's really good. So go to this house and talk on the phone. This is your dad. Excuse me, I need to see the person playing this game. Yes. Hello there. I appreciate your kindness to Nintendo. I'm the boy's dad. Could you please let me know your name? Thank you for your cooperation. Enter your name. I'm gonna go by... Dell. Obviously. Are you sure it's spelled correctly? Yes, D-E-L. That spells Dell. Thank you for spending your time with me. I too have urgent things to do, so... I better go now. Slam. Alright, so that takes care of that. Now to go find Anna. So you just take this path. And she must be inside this house. That actually looks like a church. Yeah. There's Anna right there. My daughter Anna has never been a brave girl, but she's kind of hard and has secret strength. Yeah. You have appeared just like in my dream. The boy in my dream looked just like you. Give her the hat. Are you Ninten? I must go on a trip to find my mom, and I needed your help. So I've been waiting for you, Ninten. First, let's go see what's happening in Youngtown. Daddy, goodbye. Next time, Mommy will come back with me. Believe in us. And Anna's with us. And we give her the hat. Yep, now she's got the hat on her sprite. Now let's use the onyx hook and go back to magic hands. So let's go ahead and buy some stuff for Anna, because she is going to need it. Yeah, she is very weak. But she's good with PSI. Her PSI powers are her true powers. So, let's go ahead and get the magic coin for Anna. And, uh, let's go ahead and give the magic coin to Anna. Oh, and we gotta get the frying pan to Anna as well. 
And then, uh, let's go back to our goods. Make Anna carry both. Hold on. Not talking to anybody. And not talking to anybody! Go to good. Alright. So I'm gonna do some grinding here for a second. Be right back. Alright, did some grinding and leveled up Anna a bit. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the gold ring. So that's all Anna needs right now. Alright. That's it. So, let's go ahead and put on that gold ring. And she's at level 10, as you can see. Yeah, she's gonna need to be at a higher level. Alright, now let's go. A rave debt? Couldn't even pronounce that when I first played this. And the spelling is just so weird for me up to this day. Go to mom's eyes. It's easy to fight now. Oh, Nintendo's level 20 and Lloyd's level 16. I should have thrown that out too. But yeah, we're getting pretty high leveled. I mean, we're gonna need it, so. Another mom's eyes, of course. But it can be killed in one hit, so that's good. Alright, so now we're going to be going to Spookane. Yeah, we're leaving Magicant the same way we always do, because that's the only way. We got the family again, the dad's eyes, watchers, and then the mom's eyes, the whole family. Go ahead and use the plasma beam. We're using the plasma beam on the watcher and Anna. Anna's not, you know, very strong. She's still really weak. It's just her PSI is pretty much her best weapon. <laughs> I'm not really using PSI right now because Ninten should kill everybody in one hit. But yeah, Anna definitely want to rely on PSI. All right, that's a dad die. All right, there's the dragon again. Hello, Mr. Dragon. Even though he's asleep. But yeah, the dragon, we don't have to deal with him until later in the game. Like I said before. We're almost out of here. And of course, another enemy shows up, and it's a Groucho. Is he grouchy or something? Probably. Although, he can actually just say hi, walk away, and give you some experience points. Which is nice, but not all the time he'll do it. Alright, now we got some little saucers. Pretty easy to kill. Nintendo, you know, kills everything in one hit. Well, all these enemies at least. A PSI block. We don't need PSI to defeat the little saucer. All right. Oh, Anna leveled up to level 11. That's great. She's definitely going to be needing a lot of PP. Ah, skunks. Yeah, let's kill these skunks. Kill these... These smelly animals. Of course, the crit has to land on Anna. And that takes care of the skunks. Ugh. More of these enemies. Of course, eagles. Like I said, I don't like eagles. I mean... I mean, the eagles are cool animals and all. It's just... 
You know, I told you my story about the middle school I went to. It, the eagle was the mascot of the school. And I completely hated that school. Not because of the eagle, it's just, you know, like bullies and shit. I told you my story already. I mean, it really sucked. That's why I couldn't wait for 8th grade to finally be over. Anyway, I'm gonna go heal up Anna. Like a life up alpha. And a few more hits should do the trick. Especially with Ninten. Ugh. One hit. It's, why should it be groaning for only one little lousy hit? <laughs> Okay, we're almost in Marysville, so we have a little break from enemies. Now we gotta get back on track. Literally on track, because there's train tracks here. <laughs> get it? Get back on track. <laughs> okay. So anyway, we gotta get to Spookane. Ugh, of course. Let me guess, it's the truck enemies. Oh no, it's the eagles! Freaking eagles, I hate eagles. Stop reminding me of middle school. Moving on. Back on track. Oh, are you serious? It's like the game hates me. I mean, the, it's bad enough the game is just bullying Lloyd by calling him a sissy. Now it just really wants to piss me off with all the eagles. Okay, so Anna learned a new PSI power. Please don't be eagles. Yeah, trucks. As I wanted to expect. I mean, I did expect the trucks. There's that rocket again from the Duncan factory. Now back to the train station. Let's go ahead and use the big bag on Anna. And let's see, who else needs healing? I think uh, Lloyd needs healing. And let's see. Yeah, I think I'm good. Yeah. Go up. All right, let's go to Spookane. $75. It says 25, but there's three of us, so three times 25 is 75. Now let's enjoy the ride to Spookane on this train that plays cool music. Of course, we gotta go through this really long tunnel again, but we'll be in Spookane. It'll be a while though. It's actually a longer ride. We're hopefully almost out of this tunnel. So it's a pretty long tunnel. There we go. Alright. But this is just reindeer, so we still have ways to go. didn't even stop to pick some people up if they wanted to go to Spookane or Snowman or something. <laughs> okay, here is Spookane. Alright, so... Your enemies appear in Spookane, so... I would imagine it having more sinister music, like the basement song or the cemetery song or something like that. Not some happy music. So all we need to do is fight these little saucers. Yeah, one more hit from Ninten should take care of the little saucer. Alright, let's continue on. There's actually a hotel we need to go to. Somewhere around here. There we go. Right here. So, welcome. $18 for a night. Care to stay? Sleep tight. Don't look at the beg's butt spite. Ha 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 ha. And then as soon as you wake up, you're going to have a boss battle. Thank you very much. We have a boss battle with Starman. Go ahead and fight it with Ninten. Shoot a plasma beam at it with Lloyd. And then go ahead and use PK Beam Beta. With Anna. Boom! Lloyd we'll use the plasma beam. And it is down! 
All right, so that takes care of the star man. All right, so let's continue on. So we're gonna, uh, a little saucer, Barbot, and another little saucer, of course. All right, so we're gonna be getting our fourth melody. It's in Rosemary's house, which we're gonna get to right now. So for these enemies, yeah, we'll just get them out of the way. Little saucer, PSI shield. Good thing it's not little saucer B. Because that's the one that Anna's attacking with PSI. It's PK Beam. Beta. Not that it really did that much. But Nintendo's going to finish him off. And we'll be moving on. Oh, of course. A few steps. There's more enemies. Cougars. They look like cats that are on fire. Don't they? Look kind of freaky at the same time. All right, so let's get rid of that first cougar. Take care of the other cougar. Ah, oh, of course you, you both miss. Failed us. All right, Nintendo will probably finish him off. Yep. All right, now to move on. Hopefully we don't have to encounter any more enemies. Nope. At least not right now. So go talk to this girl right here. Oh, you are such a charming boy. Just looking at you makes me feel so confident. I'm sure you'll bring that house into control. Here's the key to it. You're gonna need that key to access Rosemary's house. Which is where the fourth melody is. So let's go there right now. Oops. Enemy appears. Of course, it's the little saucer. Oh, it's actually... Never mind. It's that combo. Little saucers and the barbot. Plus one more little saucer. Usually it's just two, but now there's three. Ugh. Get rid of that Barbot. Get that out of the way. Uh. And that takes care of the first one. Little Saucer A. PK Beam. That takes care of Little Saucer B. And Nintendo will finish this off. With a single bash. All right, we're getting closer. Move. All right. Let's see, go this way. Here it is, right over here. This is Rosemary's house. Make sure you got that key from the girl that we talked to. Ghost key. All right, we're in. To so go to the top door. Top door again. We're going downstairs. You will never make it. <laughs> oh yes, I will. Except there's, there's enemies coming across. Alarm ghost. Oh boy, that looks a lot creepier than the ordinary ghosts. But I think the alarm ghosts can actually spawn more enemies to attack you. So you want to be careful of that. I think one more attack should do the trick, hopefully. No, it did not. So maybe I should really rely on plasma beams and PK beam or something. Oh, yep. But it just spawns an ordinary ghost. And of course, the alarm ghost is gone, so Lloyd and Anna cannot attack. But this ghost will be gone. We bought that in the beginning of the game. So easy. All right, moving on. Then, go to the bottom door, bottom door again, we're almost there, TURN BACK, it's all spaced out in capital letters, get whatever's in here, life up green, that's good, and then check this piano, the piano began to play all by itself, so we have half of the melodies already, so let's go back to Magic Hat with the onyx hook. All right. Now there's an item for Anna that I should get. So let's go ahead and do that right now. You go left. Oh crap. Magic snail. Maybe we're strong enough to fight them without having to 
lower their defense. Let's go ahead and, go ahead and use a PK beam. Oh, yeah. Great one. All right, one more hit from Ninten, and that takes care of the Magic Snail. Both of them. And a leveled up to level 12. Great. So we're almost there. It's not that far away. It's this cat right here. Yes, I am the cat who swims on the ground. Guess what's in my hand? Telepathy? Do you know what I have in my hand? That's right, a ribbon. This magic ribbon will give strength. Magic ribbons are only for girls. So, give it to Anna. Well, Anna already has it, so... Her force increases by four. Alright, so let's go ahead and heal up. And I think I'll just wrap up the episode after. Actually, I want to deposit some items in the mysterious good keeper's house. So, I'll do that after I heal up. Alright, so let's go back to the mysterious good keeper's house. Where is it? Down here. Green door. Alright. So, let's go ahead and uh, get rid of some stuff we don't need. We do not need that ghost key anymore. And, uh... Hmm... How about the ro uh, yeah, the rope. And I think that'll be it for this episode of Mother One. We'll see you guys in the next episode of Mother One.